dust already kicking up, the site right now is just open fields of dirt. But that is all about to change. If you could uh, go into a time machine and go five years forward, the transformation in the city downtown will be breathtaking. Milwaukee Bucks co-owner Wes Edens had a vision for this site when he and his partners bought the team two years ago. And he says he can now picture the future on this open space. Do you actually see in your mind what that's going to look like? I do. I really do. When we saw the arena originally, we knew that there was great potential in terms of the space that was there. But now, you know, you've got the, you know, the practice facility, which we'll start work on here shortly. That'll be up hopefully in about a you know, year, year and a half or so. And then all the rest of it. So I can really can visualize what's going to be there. Eden's also reflected on the often heated political battle over public funding that ultimately led to this point. I was given some advice early on to have a thick skin and not listen to what everyone said about it because people are trying to make their points and, and, uh, and just stay focused on the ultimate result and that was good advice and that's kind of how it's all turned out. And with his vision becoming reality, there is still one aspect of the new arena that Eden's can't yet envision, the name on the building. Where are you in the process of, of naming rights? Have you started discussions? We have started discussions. We've still got a ways to go. There's a lot of interest in it. I'm eager to know what's going to be called, too. But as excited as Eden's is about tomorrow's event, coming up at 6 o'clock, we'll tell you what he says will be an even bigger deal than that. And if you're still not sure of how this is all going to look and how it'll all play out. We'll walk you through this project, show you the site, explain some things, and we'll show you the one change that may impact a lot of you coming up very soon. That's at 6. All right, Ken, thank you. And here's a closer look at exactly where the new arena is being built. The main building will be constructed just north of the current BMO Harris Bradley Center near 4th and Highland. The BC will eventually be torn down. The team's practice facility and a new parking garage will be built along Juno Avenue on the old Park East land. And we're